Hi guys, it's Joanne from 15 Spatulas. Today we are going to make my slow cooker pulled pork. This is one of the most popular recipes on my site and I love it because it's so easy and you can do so many different things with the pork. You can make bruschetta, pizza, sandwiches, tons of different options. So the first thing we're gonna do is talk about our meat. And I don't like to use the traditional cut for pulled pork, which is the Boston butt, which is really the pork shoulder, because I find it to be overwhelmingly fatty. The cut that I like to use is the top loin boneless roast. This piece still has enough fat to keep things from getting too dry, but there's a lot more meat and it's a lot easier to work with. So I'm just gonna take my three or four pound piece I'm gonna place it in my slow cooker. And then what I like to do is add pineapple juice to this. I'm gonna do 12 ounces of pineapple juice. And what this does is it infuses the pork with really great flavor. And pineapple and pork go so well together. All right, now I'm gonna sprinkle the top with a generous amount of salt, as well as some freshly cracked black pepper. I'm gonna cover this with a lid and we're gonna cook this on low for eight to 12 hours. My pulled pork has finished cooking and I let this cool down at room temperature for about an hour. Now we're gonna stick this whole thing in the fridge for four to six hours. Now that this has been refrigerated, you'll see that there's hardened shards of fat floating on the top. So now it's really easy to just take a fork or a spoon and scoop it out. All right, I got all the big pieces out of there. I'm gonna take my pork and I'm just gonna move it to a cutting board or a sheet tray. And I'm going to strain this mixture just to get out any little pieces of fat. These are basically the pork juices and the pineapple juice. We're gonna incorporate them into our barbecue sauce. I'm gonna take my strained pork juices and pineapple juice. Got about a cup of liquid here. And I'm gonna add that to a pan. And then I'm also gonna add two cups of barbecue sauce. You can either make your own or you can do store-bought. I'm gonna turn my heat to medium and I'm just gonna simmer this for 15 to 20 minutes. In the meantime, I'm gonna shred the pork and you can just use your fingers or two forks to pull it apart. My sauce has thickened up really nicely and my pork is all shredded. So all I have to do at this point is combine the two and you can make sandwiches or whatever you'd like with it. So I put the full recipe and instructions in the description box below for you. I really hope you enjoyed this video and if there's anything that you wanna learn or anything you wanna see me make, let me know in the comment section below. I really love hearing your ideas. 